What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today is not about winning games. It's about It's about everyone interrupting my I can't I can't make the intro. Ooh. <laughs> I can't do it. What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today, so today the chat's trying to distract me by doing the intros, but I turned off uh, the volume. I'll turn it on for the games. Now, now, today is not about winning games. It's about conjuring as many gourmet cards as possible. Guys, look at this combo. If you play King of the Grill, every time a Garg destroys a plant, you conjure a card. So what we're going to do is just teleport Zomba and clear their field. And this is actually going to act. This will legit conjure a... Um, <laughs> A gourmet card uh, when, if you have a King of Grill on the field for every single plant that it destroys. There's a very cool combo. The other card that conjures gourmet card is Cheese Cutter. So naturally, we made this uh, a version of Teleport Zombot with Immortitia. Now, um, I am definitely going to be... This is a good competitive deck. Usually run Trickster or Mechasaur or Nurse Garg instead of King of the Grill. King of the Grill is decent though, 6, and it does have a very good stat line. Uh, the problem is you play on the field dry, very often it gets removed, but that's why we have eight teleports uh, in this deck. You want to teleport in that card, you want to also teleport in uh, your Zombot with your teleports and your teleportation zombie. Same thing with Zombot. If you play this on the field, usually the opponent just chump blocks this with one thing and then kills you in a different lane. But if you teleport this in, they can't do that, so it's actually good. Uh, the Cheese Cutter is not only a good way, a, a very strong card, very good card to teleport in, but you can just spam this on turn one, and it really does count as a control card. they got to put something in front of this Cheese Cutter, and if they don't, you end up with a huge advantage because you get these really OP uh, gourmet cards that cost one less, which is pretty awesome. Uh, we are running, man, we got a lot of card draw in this deck. Running Bounty Hunter, not only a control card, but also a um, pretty good, um, it draws cards, it controls, does a lot. Extinction Event also controlling on um, on two. Nibble is controlling on one. A little bit of heal. We just got some defensive environments. I feel like with all the cards that anyway have Frenzy, you don't really need Area 22. Guys, if you play Area 22 with Zomba, it doesn't do a bonus. If you play this into an Area 22, it doesn't do a bonus attack for every single plant that's destroyed. That's a misconception. People ask me, do that deck all the time. Frenzy only happens... When it nat it kills it through an attack. This is killing it through an ability, but it still will trigger the ability of the King of the Grill. Since there's a Garg killing a card, destroying a plant, um, then that will uh, that will conjure you a card. So the Cryo Brain is going to help you ramp up. You're going to be able to make more brains every turn than your opponent, which will give you an advantage, make it easier to control them, and also get your Zomba and your King of the Grills in faster. I think this is going to be uh, legit a very good deck. Um, instead of going for wins and losses today in the bets, as we usually do, uh, today we are going to be uh, making bets for gourmet cards. We're also instead of keeping track of wins and losses, you know, you guys in the chat will keep track of wins and losses. We'll go, we'll go, oh, I have to decide how many games I'm playing. These go, you know, I haven't streamed in a while. Let's say we're going 10 games today with this really slow deck. This will be a nice long stream. How many how many gourmet cards should the bets be though? Let's just try to figure this out. These people still distracting me from the intro. Okay, we can turn this on now. We get we'll turn on the volume. The Mets. Let's go Mets. Um, say let's go Mets. Okay, the baseball season is coming up. So it, it, let's say reasonably we conjure two gourmet cards per game. We probably will conjure fewer than that. And probably more sometimes. Should we make it 25? I'm going to make it tw 10 games, 25 conjures for the bets. So if we get to 25... I wonder if we could get to 25. I mean, you could, one Zombot can sometimes conjure just like six. You know? And that's in one game. Alright, so this is what it's going to be. It's going to be... It's going to be... Conjure 25 gourmet cards in 10 games. And yes, 25 or more. And no is going to be 24 or fewer. These are the live bets, of course. If you're watching this as a YouTube video, it's too late. 
uh live bets twitch.tv forward slash fry up guys come over to the live stream sometime we have a lot of fun but if you like watching on youtube that's good too honestly i watch a lot more just youtube videos than the live streams i don't got time i don't i'm busy i'll just watch youtube videos from the heck i want but I appreciate everyone, all the hundreds of people that come literally every day to live streams. Alright guys, we're in the games, guys. I'm taking, this is streaming this on uh, April 19th. Just took a five day break for Passover. Spent it with family. I'm really excited to be back. I wonder if I should just mulligan for King of the Grill and stuff. Alright, we have a King of the Grill. Maybe we'll tap to get cheese cutter. So, 10 games, 25 is a yes, 24 is a no. What I'm talking about. The guy's playing Forget Me Nuts. Screw this guy, I can't even do my cryo brain anymore. Come on, man. Oh, Guardian Package, it stings. We have three rockets in this deck. We're gonna use them. We're gonna need them. I think uh, these two into. Bounty should be fun. Teleportation Zombie is an extremely strong card against Grass Knuckles. He doesn't do well. Um, man, he's getting anti trick. If this is the sniper, he knows how to counter this deck. Um, it's really hard to do all the damage, but I mean, he's just dominating me right now. Alright. Really nice to have be able to play this. this Cryo Brain here. In fact, we didn't even do it, so we have to. I I'm just gonna double Cryo Brain right now. I think. I can't. We no, this guy. Is he hacking? There's no way. He just played his third Forget Me Nuts. He also played a Black IP and a Triceratops. I mean, this is has got to be the dream starting hand against a Morticia. There's nothing we can do. I'm working on this game, guys. Sorry. Have to miss this stream cause it's super late. Subscribe to Fry M up for a slight chance of set by bike released. Um, thank you to Samage. I'll see you later. And thanks for stopping by. Even though, yes, it's definitely a late stream. Just flew back to Toronto today. I spent the weekend in Minnesota with my family. Fry comes back from weekend break. Can't start intro BC. Everyone's catching up on their missed subs and donos. Especially Samich. Alright, uh, we'll just try to stall. I mean, if he just gonna has a plant food, we're donezo. Does that make us donezo? I think we're dead. Yeah, that's guaranteed. For them. <laughs> I mean, if they're talking about having literally every answer, okay. We won't even conjure a gourmet card. You know, if he hadn't actually played, it still would have been guaranteed lethal, but at least we could have conjured a gourmet card. Come on, man. Damn snipers. Alright. Warm up copium. Someone watches swim screen. Alright, guys, we're getting into it. We're 0 1. Uh, you couldn't have picked a, a harder counter to our deck than that, which is, I, you know, we don't know necessarily it's a sniper, but... Uh, if it wasn't, <laughs> he had our, definitely had our number. He's another Grass Knuckles. Alright. Uh, pretty sure we just cry over in here. The little bit of tempo we lose, we'll be able to make up in the future turns. Got a cry over in. I this is ridiculous. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't. I don't actually know what I'm supposed to do right now. I'm just getting hard countered every single round. This is not how the stream was supposed to go. I don't know, man. This is unbelievable. I every single turn and I'm just getting I'm just getting screwed every single turn. Ugh. There's really nothing I can do about this either. If I had a rocket it would be nice, but so much for that. So two and three, I guess.
Unfreaking believable. What is this? What is this game? What is, what have I come back to? This is crazy. This is complete mayhem. Uh, is there a way for me to get at least... I, I mean, hey, he usually just wins here. Is there just car? Okay, so we're at zero after two games still. Jeez, guys. What am I coming? I'm coming back to just forget-me-nots and buffs. And Black Eyed Peas. Oh, man. Alright, it's a wall night. La 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 la. Cryobrain usually does very well in this deck, but uh, yeah, I mean, not if they're just spamming forget me. I mean, that was. <laughs> Two games, we got four forget me nuts already. Alright, here we go. Uh, you play this on the ground against Wall Knight. Never make the mistake of playing it on heights. Because uh, Colonel Pulse kills it on heights. Okay, so that could counter We're having deja vu. I mean, this could just be all Guardian cards again. It doesn't have to be. It's just the fact that it's Wall Knight doesn't really matter. There's just no time to shine, right? Okay, there's the cry. Now, now we're rolling. Now we're rolling. That's why I didn't play this deck in the tournament. It just dies too hard to Guardian. Everyone was playing Guardian then. I think developing this, well, maybe not. I'm very happy that turn just going by. It'd be nice to have a second cry right there. Well, we'll save the teleportation zombie. It gets more value later. We can teleport in the big guys. This guy didn't have any forget me nuts though, so we're fine. He's not even playing, uh. Ugh. Disgusting. So we can kill this before it gets too much value. This should be fine. We can do well, we have teleports. All right, I just think playing these two might be good. Die, we're at 20 health, and we have uh, teleports and guards and all kinds of stuff. <laughs> and he's out of there. Now we're on heights. So let's teleport and King the grill either way. Yep, we're at zero gourmet after two games. I think this one we're gonna make up for lost time. We really just need an average of two. Because Cobb Cannon. I'll trade these. This is fine. Because we actually win this trade. This is fine. This is fine. We're playing control. We're playing for the zombie. We. Haha, <laughs> mine's better. Bonus, we take those. Alright, we're at one, guys. We're on the board! <laughs> Finally. On the board with the gourmet score. How do we do this? I, I think this is fun. Garlic! Okay, for real. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Okay, I take that. We'll just tank it. Ugh. Let's see if we get a teleport zombie next turn. Um, the question is, should we actually use this and bonus attack here? 
It draws a card, it, it prevents that. Yeah, I think we will. It's kind of a one for one since we draw a card. Another Zamba. Another teleport. One more would be good. Ah. Just in case he kills the, uh, the teleportation zombie. At least have something on the field. Pepper MD. Ketchup. Oh, this man. This man getting zombied. Remember that of me? <laughs> Keep playing cards. All right, we're not conjuring gourmet cards. That's a pretty damn good zomba. We also are actually conjuring one from Cheese Killer. So hell yeah. If he, you know what? He used all his cop cannons on my King of the Grills. Just makes the teleportation zombie live now. Wow, that's pretty damn good too. Bum, bum, ba, da, da. Okay, okay, guys. This is the part of the stream where we start BMing. Now, how do we do this? He'll have to block something with Zamba. I think this will be decent. Let's see if he kills this. We're at two. Oh, come on! <laughs> Alright, we got our quota. We really need 2.5 2. per game. Is that the thing? 10 games, 25. So we need 2.5 per game. We got two that game. And that was a pretty good one. I wonder how many people voted yes and no. 61% voted no. Oh, well. We're gonna get the big ones, guys. And I also definitely... Well, that guy conceded, but I'm definitely BMing hard for for Gourmet Conjures. <sighs> this is game four. We're, we're one and two right now. First non-guardian hero. Here we go. No forget-me-nots. Hey, Mr. Wall! Welcome to the stream! That's my cousin, my long-lost cousin who I met in Minneapolis. I haven't seen him in probably 13 years. Thanks for stopping by, bro. Heck yeah! Uh, that's Mr. Wall. Alright, get controlled, it's fine. I think we're gonna make a comeback in the gourmet category here. Such a safe cryobrain. I guess Black IP punishes us so hard. <laughs> and everyone and their mama runs Black IP and Captain Combustible, so yeah. It's Shroom for two. It's Cryo Brain. I feel like we're gonna get Veggie Mutation. Well, if he had this last turn, I feel like he would have played it, right? Kind of weird. I think this is fine. Really, Cryobrain into this on turn three kind of justifies it. Even if this, even if, even in this case, this is fine. It blocks six damage, draws us a card. We win that trade. One dollar. Super chickens going one dollar for every gourmet conjure. Well, so far you owe me two bucks. That's what I'm talking about. I say teleport cheese, cryobrain nibble, something along those lines. Pine clone sucks here. Bro. Alright, this is the this is the Teleport. We're going teleport cheese, guys. We'll get more teleports. Ooh. Wait a second. It was Teleport, Cheese, Cryobrain, Nibble. We'll have six next turn? Do we just take the Gourmet card or do we go for Teleportation Zombie? I think we're going for this, guys. I think we're going for this. This kind of dies after, well, two turns. In fact, we're going here. Yeah, I like the, the King of the Grill next turn against Teemo. We can support, we can we can really ex oh, there's another teleport. We can really exploit this with the King of the Grill here. And we'll have teleports for years. Really, the more teleports you have in this deck, the better. Let's just teleport everything. 
Bounty gave you cheese cutter. It doesn't count if you con if you draw it. It's got to just be a conjure. So it's got to be from King of the Grill or from Cheese Cutter to count for the score. Okay. That was very nice. Have a nice day. Get wrecked. Bats. We'll do that next. We. Plus we get more cards here. These cards are useful. That's a good nibble right there, man. Oh, we controlling this guy. Heck yeah. Oh my gosh. It's real. So that's that's another one on the score. So let's get that going. We have to three. Meteor? It doesn't matter. In fact, we draw two. If you have two King of the Grills on the field, they're both gonna draw here. This is insanity, guys. This is per this couldn't be better. This could not be better, and we don't even win the game, so we can even get more. So now we're up to five. Please don't concede. Don't concede. Don't concede. Don't concede. Heck yeah. Okay, guys. If we conjure treats from Trick or Treater, it does count. Because we are conjuring a gourmet card. We This does count, guys. This does count. Don't concede. Don't concede. Both treats are gourmet, so if you happen to conjure Trick or Treater from that... Wow, I probably should run Trick or Treater in this deck to begin with. Okay, I'm gonna keep the deck. Well, it's a breaking card. I should just run Trick or Treater. What the heck is this guy doing? All right, we're conjuring. We did it. We got it out before it can cease. Yes. Get wrecked. That's a gourmet card. Look at it. It counts. We take those. We definitely take those. It is so delicious. We're, we're totally gonna just win here, right? There's no way we can conjure another card, right? It's over. But it's six. There's no way, even if he gets Meteor, he still dies. I feel like I'd be throwing the challenge off too much by... I forgot that you can really just run Trick or Treater to conjure a plethora of gourmet cards. See, I, I really, really, <laughs> really, guys, like, for real, I mean, it doesn't really fit into the deck. I feel like I'm kind of screwing over everyone who, um, everyone who voted no by actually shoving this into the deck, because this will manipulate the score a lot. I don't know, man. But on the other hand, we're done with four games and we only have six. We're, we're at 1.5. We're supposed to be at 2.5. Alright, I'm gonna keep it for now. Here's the deal, guys. I'm gonna... If we need... If we're close for game 10, I'm gonna switch some, some trick-or-treaters in the deck. That's the deal, guys. That is El deal. Okay. Keeping these. Get rid of Bounty Hunter and put Trick or Treater instead. Maybe. I mean, the deck is always subject to change. <laughs> Even by my standards, it's still pretty drastic, though. I feel like this dies too badly to Beta Caratina's superpowers. 50% of them kill it, so I'm going to teleport this in next turn and get the conjure. Probably competitively the good play, but also... We're not being competitive. <laughs> We're conjuring. We're memeing. Oh, come on, bro. Lame. Alright, guys. We're back to the Forget-Me-Nuts meta. Everyone's hard mulliganing for Forget-Me-Nuts when they see a Morticia, so... That happens. If we can nibble this, if he just doesn't not get a photosynthesis, watch him conjure it from that. Yes! Okay. We is in the money. I might teleport this. Hi, Lucky Streak. My other long lost cousin. I have to hang out with extensively in Minnesota. Heck yeah. <laughs> I 
Here, lucky, here, lucky streak 13 and wall 203. You two know each other. You have to figure out who each other are. That's the, that's what we're doing here. Ah, should I go for the conjure or should I try to actually play well here? I don't know, man. This is gonna just kill us. This is gonna absolutely wreck us if we let it live. Alright. These are two two people I know in Minneapolis. You have to figure out who you definitely know each other. You have to figure out who each other are. <laughs> we playing games with them. Yeah, I don't know, man. Bounty Hunter seems like a good control card, but at the end of the day, you're putting a dry zombie on the field and letting them figure it out. Like, they can exploit it. Look at the exploit. Not a great exploit. I still like mine better. Evaporate is active. That's the good news. Oh, we just playing that on the ground. I hope he spike rates. You're saying Yeti also conjures lunchboxes. I didn't even consider running Yeti. I, I was just going with, like, Conjura Gourmet card, not Conjura. I think I'm not going to switch it, because I want things that say Conjura Gourmet card, not things that conjure a treat or a lunchbox, and it just so happens to be gourmet. But I will count it if we if we conjure the, like, trick-or-treater, then I will count it. Gosh, this guy's annoying. Get this weak stuff out of here. I probably should have just left that alive, actually. Oh, gain. Gain is not. Gain is conjure. It gets nerfed by the space time. It definitely counts. Alright, just king of the grill. Professional flag deck. Yeah, that's C Mac. So much fun. It's one of the two. The two decks I played casual right now, offline, is just uh, Neptuna flag conjure and then the Z Mac flag professionals. We're getting it. Holy Shamrockets! Boring card. Just boring. Who here thinks that's fun? Second question, what is wrong with you? I, I think we'll just spam this here. Uh, maybe not. Yeah, let's see you get up to six, bro. Seven, actually, because we have a nibble. Little does he know. He's probably just going to spam so many, and the nibble's not even going to make a difference. Plant Conjure Leap sometime. We have done that. Kind of. It's hard. Oh, no! Bro, stop. Stop. Okay, we actually can nibble this one, which is cool. You know, I kind of want to nibble this. Can you not play two more team-ups now? This is crazy. Brian, my message? Did I miss something? Strike through? Jeez, well, we definitely have to kill before two. Alright, we're getting up to seven as well. Hey Fry, how are you today? Cool. Happy Easter. In the future, could you consider making a Witch Hazel deck? I think it's a very underrated card. Thanks for everything. I've tried so many times. Stream. Candy as sweet as Fry. Don't tell Sandwich I took a spot. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't, I've tried Witch Hazel, it's really, the problem is when you play it, it doesn't do anything, and the opponent has a chance to react to it. Um, it's very circumstantial, I don't know. Alright, we, we just go in, we just go in in right now. Screw it, we're gonna extinction event this. I'm just going for, I'm just going for gourmet conjures. Ain't nothing this guy can do about it. Turkey dying, does that count as a kanji? Guys, I'm not doing it. I'm doing Zombot and King of the Grill and Cheese Cutter and that's it. Why is there a rock on my house? Oh yeah? That's pretty good. We definitely take those. 
I think we're getting some scores gonna score some points right now what's really going on <laughs> it's buffing man Same. uh so we definitely gotta take this card out so we'll do it like that we're we're very likely gonna get nibbles and we're actually conjuring two gourmet cards here usually also drawing and we have nibbles and stuff for that admiral all right so we're up to eight that's very cool here's nine. Oh, it doesn't even do it again nine free cheese cutter heck yeah we just need one more nibble <laughs> guys we got cheese cutters for years there's the nibble so i'm gonna go with uh seven eight Probably, well, we could probably play the environment here. All right. We're going with this. We're making it all fancy. <laughs> We're going to nibble and environment. The environment will probably leverage us to, like, make good trades and, and actually conjure more cards this turn. Here we go, guys. If I nibbled the go-nuts, then I would have conjured extra. Is that true? Oh, I guess you're right. Lame. Okay, so it's gonna be summoning, no environment. Summoning Nibble. That's a chicken. This guy's got no parts, so this, this Bird of Paradise is actually saving him. We're gonna go up to 10 at least here. Probably 11 now. That's cool. 11. Oh, we're making it. Oh, there's another nibble. See, we just have so many cards. This is legit. Like, we're just out card advantaging the opponent. I think we're gonna go after this really hard, since this is really his only way back into the game. Yeah, he's protecting it. Screw you. Uh, Do we just cover one of these? I guess we just cover we one of these. We need a leap! We need a leap! We need a leap, Hope you're having a good night. Can't wait for next highlights. I think if he doesn't counter what we have in the field, we frenzy through and win anyway. So, I mean, Blockbuster would suck. But, let's just, um... I got a card draw anyway. Let's just do this and teleport. We'll play around removal. Thank you to Paulus Gaming for five months. Heck yeah. Next fail video should be out uh, this this weekend. Woo! <laughs> this is gonna be good. We gotta conjure one more card, guys. This is game five, right? We can get halfway home. We can get to 12 here. This is game five, though. Okay, I'm, I might be off. This might be game six. Guys, what's the, what's the score? Maybe we should just be in. The question is, how hard did we BM here? So, well, actually, these trade regard. Actually, no, this dies. We actually have lethal. <laughs> the way we'd be playing the environment here and then nibbling this one. This actually goes up to, to zero cost, this one cost. Because this will die in the splash. We'll hit him for three and five. It's guaranteed. But instead, we will BM him and attempt to conjure one more gourmet card. <laughs> He's out of steam anyway. He doesn't have it. Just don't have it. Heck yeah. Alright, that's 12. We gotta get one more gourmet card this game, guys. He only has two health left. How do we do it? We got a top deck king of the grill here, guys. Ah! <laughs> Damn it! How do we possibly conjure one more gourmet card? Oh well. <laughs> this was game five. So we completed game five. 
and we're at 12. All of a sudden, after two donuts, we're halfway home. I mean, we're on par. 12 and a half is par for five games. I think this is doable, guys. I think we can totally... We just need to not face any more Guardian heroes. God damn it. What? <laughs> no! No, not Grass Knuckle. No. Bad. Very bad. Do I just get rid of this? Because it's stupid Grass Knuckles. That's fine. We're playing the Sun Heights. We're just under par. I mean, we're half a point under par. But all practical purpose. Okay. <laughs> I think we're gonna get rumbled next turn, but we do conjure a gourmet card, so we're just like that, one turn in to game six. The the total score is three and two now too, right? We actually have a winning score. Aren't we three and two? Maybe we're not. Maybe I'm high. Alright, come on, cheese cutter. Just gotta get that cheese cutter. <laughs> he rumbled. We actually blocked the rumble with the gravestone. We're just too good for this guy. But he needed to deal with... Come on, cheese cutter! <laughs> that would have been a miracle. I don't think we're doing the trick-or-treater thing, guys. I think we're just gonna go for the... Go for the real raw... Thingy. That's fine. No con... I'm the one who's conjuring stuff, okay? You're not conjuring anything. This guy should have ran for get me nuts. That's all I gotta say. Huge mistake. Cryobrain's looking good. This teleportation zombie is, is also, I mean, it's so freaking hard to deal with. Bro, no! Ooh. We actually have an evaporate here. It would be nice to evaporate this one. I mean, it just makes one card cost one less. I, I think we we just we just hold this. The truth is, though, is that we're probably just playing King of the Grill. Well, no, we can't. We have to evaporate. Well, that's rough. All right. Well, let's, let's not waste cards. He has now a, a, a legendary that costs two less. What can you do? Podfighter. B Rex. It's looking good. The other play is teleportation zombie nibble. I think we're just gonna go for this. He's really conjuring a lot here, though. It's kind of sad. We can teleportation zombie actually just here now. Alright, we're up to 14. Survey says. Pretty good. Actually, it makes the teleportation zombie kill those, which is cool. That's a rocket, which is also really, really good here. Because he's going to have a lot of expensive, big, fat cards from the Captain Cucumber. I'm probably going to evaporate this and rocket. And sugary tree. We can't really do all those, can we? Doom Shroom. Interesting. That's a really expensive card to get rid of a 6 2, not gonna lie. So we are giving him one of these. Give him one of these. Um, th the question is, should I if, should I use this here? I think this is about as good of a. I just want to really keep the health on the teleportation zombie. It's really vital. He actually didn't block. His root wall would have really kept that alive and actually killed us the next turn. We're fine. Keep it going. This is what we're really talking about. Doom shrooms again. Can you play a card, please? Besides for Doom Shroom? What an idiot. Alright. We're, we're, we're conjuring. We're going to win next turn with Teleport King of the Grill. But we have to conjure one more Gourmet card before that happens. And I will see to it. That's 
almost for sure. I don't know what he, he can have Bray. Well, if he has Bray Nana from Captain Cucumber, then yeah. Then yeah. La 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 la. Bonus attack. <laughs> Doesn't do anything. Wee. Wee. Yippee ki yay, mother father. BM value. And we're gonna be up to 15, guys. We scored, we scored three that game. That's above par. That is a way above par. What did we get? What did we, what did we conjure? Oh, brain winning. Got him. There's no way to actually conjure there without winning. So, all right, guys. So this is this is good. I'm, I have. <laughs> I'm really happy to net Brainana. Brainana's the other card besides for Black IP Forget Me Nuts and Triceratops, the other card that beats the deck. Brainana kills it. Right. Here's another Guardian Hero. <laughs> what do you know? What do you know? All right, we got one, two, three. Now the only thing that really messes this up. Wait, is this the Grass Knuckles? No, this is the this is the guy and he's sniping me. I'm gonna quit this game. This is the Grass Knuckles from game one. There's no way I, I be, I, I'm matching up with a guy with Forget Me Nuts two times in the same stream, right? An unknown hero. That's him. No, wait. This one's called Unknown Outcast. It's actually a different account. I wonder if... Ultimate... No, it's actually a different person. The, the, one, the Grass Knuckles from game one was Unknown Outcast, and this one's an unknown hero. It's super sus. I mean, come on, guys. The most sus thing ever. There's a, this is probably the same guy with two accounts sniping me with both at the same. Is this what it's come to, by the way? I don't know, man. It's not necessarily. Forget Me Nuts is probably the most common card you play in these decks. I mean, he's running the same deck. It's just gonna spit out now. Jack o' Lantern, you're so. Oh my gosh, shut up, Jack o' Lantern. For real. <laughs> Ah, uh, too cynical, man. Uh, the berry blast sucks here. I think we're playing this. Then use bats. I don't know, man. That's all I gotta say. Sus as hell. This is a really good bat. It actually kills the forgetting. <laughs> It was unknown hero and unknown outcast. Like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. Splash. You get splash harder than I do here. That's for sure. Thank you, Nemeset, for a thousand. Thank you, Nemeset. Deborah, how are you? Oh, he's nice and you pop by with your Genero City. Jeez. That happened on Heights for some reason. Um, we're going double cryo here. We're just gonna try to get really ahead in terms of the brain count. His other accounts, unknown sniper. Sniper means you're you're waiting, you're like basically watching a per a streamer and you're trying to face him on purpose. And then hard counter. <laughs> part of it all right teleport king looks good if he plays forget me nuts we have this instead eh, 10 bucks oh late to the party i think i like well i like blocking very much I think three bullseye is arguably scarier even than four. This also two health makes it easier to deal with in so many ways, especially than they block. But we did conjure a gourmet card. Uh, we're in a little bit of trouble here just because how much damage we're taking. Kinda needed that block there. We're up to 16 though. We have some health. So it's gonna be. I might just Zomba next turn. We're gonna go like that. We're gonna go like this. 
Uh, Nibble and Extinction looks really good here. I don't know, man. Clear a blast. I think we're good. We need a leap. Keep that. We need a leap. And Nemesis, subscribe. Thank you for 17. Heck yeah. Okay, this is fine. We are just going to do that. We have the full block meter. We actually win this trade because um, we we draw a card from that. I would really like to teleport Zombot this game. There's another card. Okay, we're close to it. Heck yeah. I'm gonna try to play around Blockbuster. I'm gonna play both of these. This isn't a huge threat. Guys, I think this is the dream. I'm just BMing him. I'm seriously, I'm going, we're playing for Zombot. We play for Zombot. Oh no, wait, this doesn't live. No, the king of the grill dies. Is there any way to, oh, there's no way to save it. Lame-o. None of our superpowers do anything here either. Lame. Wow. Lame as hell. Alright. Well, at least we conjure this way. If I use six powers, let me down. 17, guys. We're, we're on a roll. This was pretty good. I wanted to get the Zombot version. Okay, if we get another King of the Grill, we're definitely playing it this turn. Double Berry Blast to face? I don't think he had. Oh, no. Okay, we can nibble. This does six, right? Ugh, a lot. So it's gotta be Nibble Zombot, right? <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah, Nibble. Gotta Nibble first. Get ready for impact. Zombot! Zombot almost kills us. Thanks, Zombot. Ow. We're totally gonna just get Berry Blast in the face here. This is not okay. We got many Zombots. Oh no. For real? <laughs> For real? <laughs> no! <laughs> we lose. It wouldn't have even mattered if we had played it here because the blocks. Alright, we'll go out on our own terms. We still got a lot of gourmet cards that game, so that's a win. Too bad. Very sad indeed. Guys, what's the what's the score? What's the, the, the wins and losses count? It's so hard to keep track of that. I should just keep track of my score on my thing. I'm not gonna like... I'll just update the score. I won't show it on the stream, but there's no room for it. Okay, here we go. Here we go. It's another Grass Knuckles, guys. Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. All it is is just another Grass Knuckles. We have to evaporate. That's good. So I would have saved the other teleportation zombie, I could have blocked damage in case he plays two two grapes of wrath. Good idea. I think it's too that's that's a case of being way too easy to say after the fact what I should have done. You know what I'm saying? Wait guys, what's the score? What's the score? What the heck is this? This is really? This or that? Really? Really? They're just an environment here? Okay. 
That was seven. This is eight. What is the actual wins and losses there? Let's just say we're five and two. This supposedly is game eight. Now we're on game seven? No one's keeping... Where's Spearton? See, everyone gets annoyed at, at Spearton that he does the thing. Every game he's like, it's game six. We get... But we need that or else we're all dumb. Okay, hold on. I'm going to go find out what game it is. Sorry, this guy. I'm roping you. I don't care. Okay, so the first game, we lost to Grass Knuckles. And the second game, didn't we lose to two Grass Knuckles? There's one. And there's the second one. We lost to Grass Knuckles. So we're 0-2. Then we beat the Swall Knight. So we're 1-2. And, and then we beat Captain Combustible. So we're 2-2. Two two. We played Beta Caratina. And we won that. So we're three and two. Sorry, I'm roping. Three and two. And then we played Grass Knuckles. We won that one. So we're four and two. And then we played B Spadow. And we lost that. That was the last game. So we're four and three now. This is game eight. How do I, what am I supposed to do here? Nothing, pass. Well, I buff this guy. There's no reason to. Right now, the score is four and three. This is game. Eight. All right. That's why. That's what the YouTube stream is just useful for. Other than that, completely useless. Okay. We're gonna cryo brain. We'll give him one of these. Now we're taking way too much damage. I don't even know what to do now. We're gonna just play for Zombot, I guess. Alright. We're chump locking the King of the Grill. Let's also conjure us a card theoretically next turn, so. <coughs> I say it's a win. We also actually have a nibble to, to waste here. We need. If he plays like a B Rex, I'll do it. Oh, yay! Fun card! Absolutely nothing wrong with Sham Rocket. Just completely fine card. Beauty. Okay, so then it's dead. Where's our rockets? We're running the rockets. Got a chump lock, one of these. <sighs> the trigger happiness continues in the chat. Guys, come on, guys. It's okay if you call me out. Don't be trigger happy, though. What is he doing? He's playing Spike Wind Sector? What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> that was hilarious. That was legit hilarious. What, 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 why, why though? Uh, it's because he didn't want, it's a, he didn't want me to draw a card. It actually makes sense. I think that was legit. Uh, there's no point in spending the nibble here. Manifest. No, this isn't Legend of the Rune Terra. It's not called Manifest. Alright, I say we reset this stuff right now. <laughs> okay, don't call me. It's bad. I'm in the middle of streaming. Come on, Mom. It says it on my WhatsApp. You gotta, gotta text before calling. Always text before calling. Come on, man. All right, guys. I say, I say to this guy, I say, do your freaking worst. I'm playing this in four, so it doesn't like play a, a banana source Rex that gets extra damage from blocking this turn. We have the full block meter. It's our only saving grace. Oh, gosh, that we can nibble next turn. That's the good news. Yay! Buy it. Okay. We're probably not playing Zombot this turn. We're gonna wait till we get a teleport. We are gonna just spam all the rest of these cards. <sighs> Bruh. Did we just lose here? 
don't have a minion. Oh, we're fine. We evaporate that next turn. So it's gonna be a yo. And nibble. I think that's it. And then we just zombot. This will be four or five. I think we just draw a zombot now. Well, we can, it's Zombot, but then we can play like Extinction Event and stuff, so like, sir. We just have to not, this just not kill us. Oh, whoops. Sorry, I messed it up. The gourmet score. I, I accidentally pressed export because I'm stupid. Oh no. Okay, that's damage we can't afford. Aha! Teleport. Okay, this is how we're doing it now. I mean, we died a Blockbuster, but otherwise we died to a lot of other things, so we'll live and die with the Blockbuster here. Heck yeah! Clank. No! The Zomba went out. So we didn't get any gourmet cards that game. So now the score is 4 and 4. <laughs> Here's game 9, and we're still stuck on 17, man. Solar Flare, finally! Non-Guardian! <laughs> That's right, I mean, Solar Flare is a good hero, it's just I don't want to play against Brie. There's no forget me not no Black and be no Brianna. I think this is a very good thing. Been begging for a rocket this whole okay. Oh, these are so good against the yeah, okay. Well, okay, we're good. I think we're gonna teleport this in. You don't really want to play this into the summer, and we do have the answer to Haunted Pumpkin, which is very, very good thing. You are garbage. Don't think we spend a card on you. I'm half of a card, but I do think we do. I think we play control here. We do have Nibble Bats, which is an option. We also just have Cryobrain if he passes. Let's see what happens here. I think saving the teleportation zombies for a little bit is going to be better. Now, we don't actually have to Nibble this, but it's going to have two attack. Screw it. Screw it. We'll be at 20 with a block meter charge. We'll go for a teleportation zombie cheat here. You don't have to cry over here. Let's just keep them up. <laughs> Did I do it again? Sorry. I have this natural instinct. I always press export. Now, the way I, I update the score is I have a Photoshop, free Photoshop called GIMP. Why do I use the free one? Because I'm Jewish. No. Uh, <laughs> it's because I... I started, I didn't want to invest too much money when I started, like, in Photoshop and stuff. So I just got used to doing GIMP, and that's how I do it. So, I export this image of 4-4. Four four. I just, that's just what I, god damn it. It's just what I export. We're going for Gourmet Synergy, I don't care. We can bin out a bomb, that's fine. Durr. Durr. <laughs> yes, it counts! We count those. We count those. We're up to 18. Do we have a nibble? We need a leap. No, we don't. We Wait, guys. Thank you, Beats, for four months. Hold on, hold on. We have to do this right. We got a dirtish right. Okay, I'm gonna play this plus environment, I think. Yes. This is game nine. But that's, we're going to conjure a lot of gourmet cards from the, it does count if it comes from Trick or Treater. That's what we're going with here. That is fine. We're going to do this to deny him the card. But we're going to get the, the we're going to get the, the gourmet cards next turn. It also makes this Trick or Treater kind of thick. Which is very good indeed. There's a nibble, so it's gonna be two. Wow, we don't even need a ramp anymore. We just need this not to get buried blast and ruin our turn. We're probably gonna nibble, play a card, and oh, this is gonna be good. What, he's gonna scorch this? You infidel! Wait, 
He can't have Scorch, he's weed wave. God damn it. The man's a complete infant. Wow, we didn't even get it. <laughs> oh well. Alright, we're giving him one of these. And we are conjuring here. Heck yeah. We'll be up to 19. That idiot just killed my... Killed my stuff. He killed my shiz. I think we do this... Nah, I think we do this... Well, I think we do this. It means this dies to Berry Blast. We have so many of them already. We really need the card here. Heck yeah. Corv. 19. That's a nibble. Nibble, nibble, nibble. I know, very sad indeed. <laughs> Let's go get it. No! Okay, yeah, it's still doable. Wow, look at the acid rain value. See, this is why I saved it. The acid rain is just insane here. Insane. It's insane. It's crazy. We should conjure unless he Cali rolls. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Nah. 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 God damn it. We have the conjure and he blocked it. Piece of guard. Okay, he has 13 health left. I think there's more conjures to be had. That man played into acid rain like nobody be. All right. We're going to invest all these cards to conjure more things from Cheese Cutter, which is the right play, by the way. Yes. Getting ready for more conjures. This just means more we got to get some King of the Grills going. Come on. This is the game we get to 25 right now. They did a game. They did a game. Okay. Eh. I've seen worse things in my... In my, in my, well, uh, we don't spend a nibble on that. We're at full health, dude. All right, guys, we're gonna have to 20, just like that. This game's still gonna take. Oh my gosh, he's healing. That's good. More, more, more conjures. More, more cheese cutter. More cheese. Oh my gosh, where is King of the Grill? We have the teleportation zombies. We need the King of the Grill so badly. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. What is going on here? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Ow. See, the guy is going to basically be in a top deck situation, which means we can totally BM him to the Ice Age. I don't really even need to use that. Uh, extinction event it looks very cute. We'll just save it. It doesn't do enough. And we still have a teleportation zombie. He's not drawing any cards. Thank the Lord. Praise the Lord. He's at 15 health still. That's fine. <laughs> okay. We're at 15 health now. He only has one card though. How is he gonna he's not gonna be able to do it? This is a con this is a come on King the Grill, where are you? <laughs> no. Okay, we're gonna lose this game. He very blasted that. That's bad. Always cry rain them in the face. I think we nibble this one. I probably should just extinction event this, right? Just so this is doing two per turn. It's just gonna be charging our block meter instead of killing us. This is fun. I also have no cards, but I do have a lot of conjures in this deck. There's a rocket, just in case. <laughs> the battle of the losers. It's core versus the 2-2 two -two me catch-up mechanic. I wish it was a 5-5. Five -five. That's fine. We block here. Um, I'm gonna say yeah. That's kind of scary. Aha! I wish I was in an environment. Don't kill my core! That's fine. What is the last card? He's been holding this card for a long time. Now, we could play Zombot. I feel like 6 plus 9 is 15. The moment we get... Okay, I'm not playing Zombot. If he plays anything big, we rocket it anyway. We're BMing for... We're looking for our King of the Grill. We're just gonna dry King of the Grill into the in Nebula and then Zombot him till he dies. 
We're gonna conjure so many gourmet cards. I just gotta be patient here. Okay, that's good. That's fine. <laughs> that's, this is why we keep... What? This was a reincarnation. He was waiting to be a big card. This is what he was holding, by the way. Oh my gosh, he gets Astro from Astro. That's beautiful. Okay, okay, okay. This is very scary. I'm very happy I have a rocket. See you later. Come on, King of the King of the Grill conjures. Well, it's, it's two cards here. It's not even enough. Come on, King of the Grill. Where are you? That rate doesn't do anything. We're gonna just have to take this at some point. Oh yeah. I mean, four two. It means he needs five. He has two cards to be able to deal five damage. I say we still go for more conjures. Uh oh. No! Wow, for real? It's guaranteed lethal and there's not a damn thing we can do about it. A cosmic mushroom carried the game, man. Alright, guys. Well, this is what it all comes down to here. We lose. It's guaranteed. We, that, that was game nine. The, the, the score is four and five, but whatever. It doesn't, that, that part doesn't matter. Guys, we got one game. We got to get five. We got to get five kind I thought we were going to get a lot that game, man, but we just didn't get King of the Grills, man. Just didn't get it. And getting two there would have been so good. We got to get five this game. It's bros. Okay. Okay. I'm try to grab teleportation zombies many as humanly possible. Pretty good hands. This is game 10 now. We gotta get five conjures for it to be a yes. I'm not going with the trick or treat. I think we can do this, guys. I think this is doable. The man has stung. So. Guys, we have rockets, it's fine. What if it turns into cheese cutter? I need cheese cutter so badly. This is the Game Boy. This is tense. This is some... This is some tense shiz right here. Playing for Jelly Bean, it must be. Why else would you play this dry on turn three? Is a... For real? Oh my gosh, okay. No. See ya. <laughs> we rock at those. He has four in his deck. He top deck one. Okay. He draws about one in ten chance. Okay, now, now, now for real. Now for real. We're gonna play patient. It's teleport, teleportation, zombie M5, and we get this on six. Where the heck did this man get? He got black eyed feet. It's beautiful. This is just staying here. I think we just passed here. We don't really need to... We don't really need to, to summoning. This is not a, a lot of damage. It just makes this a pain later. Three, four, five. Do we use two teleports here? Is it crazy? We could just do this. Let's just... I think we'll deal three damage. Winter Squash. Okay, here's a Gourmet card. That's fine. Acid Rain, Acid Rain. Uh, it's probably stupid, right? We're up to 21, guys. That's a 5 coster. Guys, we top decked a 5 coster. That means we can, we can, oh my gosh, you don't know how good this is. For the agenda of this stream, the 5 cost King of the Grills miracle, we can pass now. We can pass safely, and if he somehow kills the 1 too, which is a lot of ways he could do that, we, god damn it! Okay, okay, no, 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 this is not happening. We're not just gonna get Brianna to the Ice Age today. This is not, no, we had, we had so many there. We had so many. Okay, we do get an extra one, 22. We just need three more, actually. 
Oh my gosh, we got Trick or Treater. <laughs> guys, we're gonna pull it through with Trick or Treater, guys. We do play this, right? Doesn't really matter which one. This is doable. This is doable. As long as he doesn't have another Brainana, we're fine. Can you please not have another Brainana? Gosh, that's so much damage. There we go. Here we go. Okay, we're up to 24. We're, up, we're on the edge. I think we have plays against Dragon, too. We'll just teleport in something. I don't care if we lose this game. Oh my gosh, we're down to actually like one health here. La dee da dee da. 24. Oh no, we're milled. Oh no, we're milled. Oh no, we're milled. That's bad. Ladies and gentlemen, this is very bad. He mogs that. We're milled. We're milled. We're milled. We're very milled. Very, very, very milled. We're excessively milled. Okay, we need to conjure one more card. This, this we can do. We have two, and then we'll play six somewhere. We're either playing. We're either playing a trick, or we're playing or teleporting a king of the grill. The only thing we really lose the game to right now is Brainana. Dragon is fine. Dragon is a hundred percent. We win the challenge against Dragon. We lose the challenge to Brainana right now. That is okay. Guys, ladies and gentlemen, we freaking did it. We did it. We got 25 gourmet cards. Don't do some BS right now. No, 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 no. We did it, guys. This is turn. I just wish there was a way for us to. I wish there was a way to get the Zombot, though. That's the problem. How do we get how do we make this live? I want to get the Zombot. I want to get the Zombot play. All right. I think we just take it like this, right? I can't think anymore. That does conjure a card. We do get the 25. We did it. Now let's try to win this game. We'll make it 5 and 5. We'll break even on the challenge here. We did it, guys! 25! I want to do the Zombot thing, though. Is there a way to do it? Is there a way? How do we... Do okay, we can rock it. I think we can probably... Do some stupid Zombot things right now. We have the rocket here. And he hasn't really had a dragon or anything. The answer is yes. I want to try to pull off one game, pull off this, this, this combo here. I think we might be able to do it. Heal. I think this might be... He has 20 health. We have a lot, a lot of wiggle room. Wiggle, wiggle. As long as he doesn't get a brain in <laughs> okay. Mm hmm. That was fine. I didn't do anything. Playing that instead of going to face because he needs one damage, but instead of going phase, he just does that. Okay, so it's evaporate first. We live here. We're gonna grow. He's summoning. Sumo. See, we, we don't, if we had one more brain, we could have teleported in a King of the Grill here and then Zombotted the next turn. We're so close, too, man. Uh, we rock it. We cryo brain. And we'll go from there. Save the teleports. Man only has a couple of cards now. We need like a teleportation zombie or something to teleport in here. 
I guess Teleport Zombot does it. Teleport King of the Grill bonus attack also conjures a lot of cards here. And it doesn't actually, well... Hmm. Never mind, we lose. <laughs> Never mind. We did get 25, though. I want to do this thing so badly. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, well. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. We did it. The answer is yes. The answer is yes. We got exactly 25. Exactly 25 gourmet cards. What a successful stream. That is what I'm talking about. Right down. Went right down. <laughs> man, I the stream almost just lost the game of the spot. Come on, Dragon Man. That brain damn almost got us. Jeez. Ugh. All right, guys. That is all I got for tonight. It's like 11.15 p.m. I don't even know why I'm streaming today. I spent the whole day traveling back to Toronto. Yeah. Because I love you guys. I missed you. And I wanted to do this thing. Thank you to my friend Brian from Minneapolis for giving me this idea. Much per share. Um, we got the 25 gourmet cards. This is absolutely fantastically going on YouTube. I don't care the fact that they had scores 4 and 6. I don't care. I don't care. Hope you guys enjoyed. I certainly did. Peace. This is Fry.